My Paul Skakoman, a cooling horror leaning Angeles, and today I'm gonna fly this 737-800 on a little special flight that I want to do from San Francisco into Las Vegas. So, and today the library we have here is something special for me. This is America West. I don't think this airline is flying anymore. It's been absorbed into U.S. Air and then to American Airlines, I think. So I accidentally in the right place, it seems. Anywho, I don't think America West ever flew the 800. I'm not sure if they were around for that or not. Why are the strobes on? But yeah, this is one of my favorite airlines. Oh, strobe instead. I went supposedly this way. Okay, there we go. Because I remember seeing this airline quite a bit in back when I lived in Colorado Springs. It was one of the features at the Colorado Springs Municipal Airport. They had a, a different library back then. This is the newer library, I think, before they vanished. I do kind of miss the old colors of the very colorful American sky back when they, way back when you had America West, West Pacific, Northwest, the Big Three were still there, and a bunch of others. But now I guess we're getting, it's coming back now, we've got like JetBlue and Frontier. So I guess, but now it's like Airbus taking over instead of Boeing. Anyways, enough talk. We're all set up to go, so let's go ahead and shut the doors. Well, first remove the ground handling. Ground handling, drive away. So they're gonna drive away. And let us continue with our flight. And once the bulk loaders are moved out, I'm going to go ahead and shut the door, cargo doors. So this airline is called America West, so we need to fly in the American West. And this guy flies away, not flies away, drives away. Ah, he clips, he clipped through the loaders. Yeah, I guess I'm parked in a not so great place for the ground handling to come and service us okay there they go so let's go ahead and get the doors that we can shut shut cabin landing before i forget take off landing white medium so just to check it's kind of important with this airplane to configure your hardware. No dual access on yaw, good. Otherwise, you'll get some interesting things when you try to turn the airplane on the ground because I don't have a tiller set up. Forward entry close. Forward service close. Aft service close. Forward and aft cargo close. Let's check. Okay, the doors are closed. Yep, all the doors are closed. We can go to our... We can switch on the beacon now. This is the anti-collision beacon goes to on. Doors are all locked. Good for us. Ground services, remove the chops. Wow, good stuff. Certainly will. So, this is going to go to all. Alrighty, so that's that. Let's call the pushback. But first, Better push back, request push back, but first things first. Cycle of parking brakes. Make the jetway move away. And put it back on. There we go. Request push back. 
Ground to cockpit. Tow is driving up. All right, here we go. So let's go back to our. Um, checklists. Engine starts gonna come before the pushback is over, so tax switches gonna have to go to off to get us ready. APU bleed is on, okay. Hang on a second, we will get your temperatures back in a bit. Your cabin temperatures, so that you won't burn or freeze. It's 11 degrees, so I'm more worried that you'll freeze. Okay, all doors and hatches are closed. Ready to connect. Please connect. Ready to go. You see our beacon is lit up. 58A is our gate. Okay, there we go. I was wondering earlier when I was doing the FMC inputs. Okay. Their plane being hydraulically lifted. So connected and bypass pin inserted. Release parking brake. Parking brake released, sir. There we go. Okay, that takes a while to register, I guess, with the better pushback packages off. Starting engines. So we are starting right today. So right goes to ground start. Let's monitor this. I think it's 25% in one. Or in two, I'm sorry. We introduce fuel. Okay. Start her off. Engine is off. Start valve open extinguished. Let's go for the second engine. Return to ignition left. Ground start. Down, please. Oh boy, I missed it. The mark. There we go. Let's connect the hand signals. All right, popped off. That's good, gonna go ahead and put this guy on both. Done. So push back. After push back. So is disconnected and bypass and has been removed. Hand signal will be on the right. We'll see you next time and have a great flight. Thank you, sir, and we will see you next time as well. Ice air conditioning, okay. 
good signal so hydraulic pumps can go to on now bring that pressure up okay so engine start done for taxi generators one and two on probe heat on gonna go ahead and shut the APU down We've got power. Bring an engine anti ice, don't need pack switches, set those to auto. Get some air flowing back there again. Isolation valve goes to auto. APU bleed goes to off. Okay, good. Engine starts, which is to go to continuous. Start levels are on idle. Okay, and ground equipment's clear. Set takeoff laps to 15. Okay, that's that. Those are going to come down. Flight controls checked, so let's go out here and hit systems. Good, 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 and good. Okay. Lower to you, hit it here twice, it's blank already. And then we go take off. So, we do that when we get there. We're going to turn this taxi light on. And let's get out of here. The APU should be shutting down, right? Yeah, off. Oh, yeah, there it is. It's already shutting down. Alrighty, let's go. And I'll catch you guys on the runway. Alright, we're back. So, do the takeoff checklist. Departure runway verified correct. 28 left. Yes. Okay. The strobe's gonna go on before we enter the runway. Because once we enter, I'm not gonna have time to do anything else. So, okay. The strobe's gonna go on. Other lights as needed. So, get the landing lights out there. And the wing lights can stay off. Okay. Transponder T A R A. There we go. Set up. Okay, fixed landing lights go on. Plus levers do this. Then we'll get this after the actual takeoff. Because we don't have two sets of hands. So let's go. Flight attendants, please take your seats for takeoff. Okay, yeah, nothing there about that. Okay, so let's go ahead and push up a little bit. Okay, here we go. 
coming up. Once we get lined up, we'll go ahead and hit the N1. Oh wow. It's a bit overcast out here today, eh? Okay, we're lined up. And one go. Take off power. Here we go. I guess I can't move any of the control systems where it'll come down. There we go. Stay where you are, stay where you are, stay where you are. doing that for? 400. 400. Why is it surging the engines like that? Maybe that's why? Put the throttle in the right place too? 1,000. Yeah, that's why. I have to put the physical throttle out here. Like on my stick in the right place in order for it to work properly got it, I got it Got a bit of a crosswind on takeoff today. We have to gain some airspeed so we don't get low again. Oh, the chronometer. A clock. Right. Getting blown. That's what the captain meant by a little bit of a bumpy, well, captain being me. My in universe X plane self meant by a bumpy right out what he meant. Uh, and there's the chorus of dogs outside my window again. Hold on. Okay, the doggos have calmed down a bit, so now we can continue flying. Oh boy, don't break 250. It does feel a bit bumpy up here. We're going to get a tailwind that's going to help us along the way. So I feel like we're going to land pretty heavy. I could have not brought as much fuel. Okay, 8,000 feet. Right, 
flying rather smoothly. The same in one power all the way up, I suppose. That'll probably switch to speed eventually. Okay, come back over. thousand hit the autopilot okay so bring in the landing lights turn off the taxi light checklists take off did these okay set as needed as needed auto brake off landing gear lever off okay find the cruise passenger sign we keep it there. Let's go ahead and do this. Do the auto. There we go. That was already on both. Okay. Passenger sign, let's check outside. After this turn, we'll turn it off. Altimeter, not 18,000 yet. Okay, so that's that. Good for us. Alright, and I'll catch you guys on. Hopefully when we're close to final or maybe when we get closer to the set, we'll see how the conditions allow. See you at the next update. At the top of cruise actually. We'll catch catch you at the top of the climb. Catch you then. Okay. We are up. We've got a bit of harsh turbulence here. We turn in that's gonna turn into a tailwind though. But push us along quite nicely. So, what verse are we going to use today? Hmm. Let me think. First things first. Uh, while I'm thinking, hang on for a second. We're in a bit of a turn, so after the turn, we'll go back into our cabin to hang on a sec. Already I've got our verse, our verse, so just wait a second for this turn to finish. We're up in the right speed now. I think I'm gonna give us an extra 5,000 feet of altitude here. That ought to help. Yeah. 
Let's go 350. Get away from some of this marginal turbulence here. Execute. Alright, let's do it. And our fuel at. We're not ready for that yet. Okay, so. Okay, don't go over speed just yet. Anywho, I'm gonna. Okay, there we go. It's tabling off now. Anywho, let's go have a look. Flight deck door unlocked. Go do our verse. Yeah, you can hear them. You can hear the passengers. On this America West flight into Elvis Presley Town. Las Vegas. There's a couple there. Um just ghost over here to this exit seat. Take a look here out, out of the wing. There's our America West colored engine. And you can move the um what is it? The shades up and down apparently. Okay, this is getting kinda bad. So let's do the verse first. Alrighty. Ephesians 289. And we'll put the screen on like this. And here we go. Ulinking kalam maka. Oops. Ulinking kalam maka. Maka kapus. Oh boy. One more time. Ulinking kalam maka kapus. Kayuking pamalita naning ka. Kasapanataya. Kasapantayana. Okay. Start over again. Ulinking kalam kakapus kayo king pamalita nanin kas kasapantayana at ye ipat ke kay muri iti kalam nanin jos. E king muri daring dapat pang minuman ea magbaranga. Alright, one more time. Ulinking kalam makakapus kayo king pamamali bilata nan pamamilata nanin kasapantayana at ye ipat ke kay muri iti kalam nanin jos. Eking ulida tarading dapat pang ninuman teya pagparanga. For by grace are ye saved through faith, and that not of yourselves. It is the gift of God, not of works, lest any man should boast. Okay, there we go. And that's the verse for now, so let's get back to the cockpit. Oh, wow. The um, jet stream is pushing us along quite nicely. Have that closed and lock. Ooh, it's kind of bumpy up here. Anyways, I'll catch you guys on the descent. We'll handle this problem if it comes along. It's turbulence, so just give the warning. Yeah, so I'll see you guys on when we're close to final. This is not the new airport. I'll see you guys when we're close to final. Alright, we're getting pretty close to final. It's making the last turn. So this is done. Localizer capture not ready yet. Okay, good. It's up. Landing gear lever. I glide up alive. Not ready there yet. Actually, yes, it is. The light up is very much alive. Just have to catch the localizer hole. Okay, we're still on course. Don't surge the engines. Flaps 
15, which starts, which is continuous. Speed brake lever, not yet. Okay. Still following this good path. So when we get to Shan, that's when things should be set up for the landing. We're actually only 4,000 feet above the ground right now, so yeah. And here we're only going to be 2,000 feet above the ground, so this is good. Go ahead and put the gear down. One green, two green, three green. Now I'm locked. Lining up. Okay. I have a, I have a visual on it. Keep the speed brakes up. So we need to go ahead and start. I'm gonna go ahead and go out the flaps full. Get in the little narrow pocket. Hold this there. Yeah, we're high. I think that's the right runway over there. Oh, this is it right here where we're coming in. That red. Reference over 1.50 is there. Here we go. All right, there we go. Good stuff. We're ready. Now I'm gonna go ahead and disengage this. We are full flaps, gear is down. Just a bit windy. Oh, come on. Auto bottle had to go off, sorry. That wasn't going to be a very good approach if the auto bottle was kept on. Kept surging the engines. Twenty-five hundred. Yeah, I got it. There we go. Here we come. Ooh, we're getting blown. There's a pretty harsh crosswind coming in here. Yeah, this crosswind is harsh. Yeah, 
Here it comes. One thousand slow. Thousand feet stabilized is low. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. This approach isn't gonna be good, but this crosswind is harsh. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Little bit. This is a small plane. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Yeah, I know. Light slow. Light slow. Purposely coming in a little bit. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Okay, right there. Five hundred. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. This should catch us soon. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Five hundred. Light slow. Light slow. Are we on the wrong one? Light slow. Light slow. I think I'm on the wrong one, right? Oh well. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Four hundred. We'll just use this one. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Three hundred. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Two hundred. Middle oh boy. Gotcha. Slow. Continue. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. One hundred. Light slow. Light slow. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Long landing. Ten. Reverse. 80 knots. I think I landed with my speed brakes up there. Whew. Okay. There we go. We are in. Off. Whew, that was a bit tough. I'm going to vacate the runway and then have a stop here. No replays because I haven't actually tested it with this airplane yet. I know before it messed up, so I need to do some off-camera flying to test the replay system on this airplane first. Whew. Okay. After landing. Auto brake off, speed brake lever down, probe heat off, come on, frames, there we go, probe heat off, exterior lights is needed, Engine start switches to auto. Probably should have put out the um what is it? Retractable landing lights. Weather radar off, that tail doesn't work, flap lever up. Okay, bring the flaps in. Transponder. Put the standby. I don't think it has expander mode. Yeah, no expander, so let's go to standby. Okay. 
And of course the APU has to come on. Right, come on. And wait till it gets to four and then let it go. Right, there it is four. Let it go. Shut down. Okay. That's for when that's for when we get there. So let's go to the gate which is right here. And I'll come back when we are close to it. Sorry for the silence, I forgot to go to the parking. That jetway looks like it's messed up there, so we'll see how that works. Stop blinding this guy. I'm not sure if Sam is installed here or not. Check to make sure. Airport operation system. Parking. Not recognizing the door, I see. Okay. Therein lies the problem. Alrighty, so shut down, parking brake set, electrical power. Set. Start levers to cut off. Okay. Fasten seat belts off. And the beacon goes off. It's coming. That's cool. Okay, that works. Fuel pump switch is off, except for I think this one's supposed to stay on because the APU is powering it. Come on, there we go. Cabin utilities as needed, IFB passenger seat as needed, wing anti-ice off. It was never on. Get these hydraulics off. Anti-ice off, hydraulic panel set as needed, auto. AP bleed's gonna go on. Isolation valve open.
Okay. Engine bleed on, AP bleed on, exterior lights is needed. So oh, the frames. It just goes to steady and everything else stays the way it is. Sam worked. I was flight directors off. Transponder standby, AP switch as right, it's done. Okay, so let's forward entry, forward service, aft service, forward cargo, aft cargo, lighting. Forgot to put it in cruise, but back to the bright lights. And let's get the ground handling trucks up. Catering. Okay, drive up. Here they come. We need to set the chalks. So the plane doesn't roll away without us wanting it to. And that's it, 737-800 from San Francisco to Colorado Springs. I mean, San Francisco to Las Vegas. I keep thinking Colorado Springs because that's where I first ran into America West when I lived there for... I was back in the 90s. Alrighty, so... There we go. And I think that we are ready. Right. And my balls people on. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.